Well, good morning. This morning our scripture is found in Colossians chapter 1 verse 17 and it goes like this. And he is before all things and by him all things consist. Did you know how great our God is? Our creator. The one that made us. Well, I'll tell you what. God is the one that holds this universe together. Sure is. <laughs> you know, our earth, planet earth that we live on, and it has the precise distance from the sun that is essential for life. That's what, that's what scientists tell us. If it was to move 5% closer to the sun, we would fry. We'd just burn up. Or if we went 5% further away from the sun, it would be just a big old bicycle here. The, print, the planet would freeze. That's how great our God is. You know, whenever you just sit back and you ponder about the greatness of God, our creator. My little old mind just can't take it all in. No, it, it can't. And, you know, I like to think of it as, you know, God is, is the glue that holds us together too. Yeah, he knew exactly what he was doing when he made us. Knitted us together in our mama's wounds. And that's that's the kind of God I serve. And I hope and pray that you do also. Because we serve a great, great, big, wonderful God. Our creator. He is my everything. And I hope you feel the same way about him. If you don't know the Lord Jesus Christ, his son, God's son, that he sent here to old earth, that died on the cross for us, just so that we could live in eternity with him, if only we believed. And ask him to become the Lord of our life because we serve a wonderful God that loves us. He surely does. Well, I hope that you consider these things today, how wonderful, wonderful and great our God is. May God richly bless you. I love you, but better yet, Jesus loves you. He died on the cross for us, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye now.